Hi, I'm Jenny. I'm with Auto Trader Classics and my father and I are about to go out on a road trip. We're going to go on a journey to get a Plymouth Roadrunner and we would love for you to follow our journey. And this is my dad. This is Ron. And I am ready to go. Make it worth driving all the way. It really looked like the guy had done a really meticulous job of restoring it. It's just out of love that he does it. And I kind of got that from him when I talked to him. So that was another thing that made me think of it's a long drive, 700 miles. Yeah. 700 miles just, <laughs> just, <laughs> just to check see, it out. Just to check it out. The pictures look good. Let's just hope it looks as good as it did in the picture. As you can see, we have the lovely. Atlanta weather. Here, are you doing okay with the weather? Yeah, not bad. I'm just worried if you got your seatbelt on or not. <laughs> I have all my seatbelt on. That's, that's good. I mean, probably the closest thing I've gone to um, Twitter or Facebook is the auto trader. Oh, uh, the community? Yeah. The You're Zog. Community. I am Zog. You're known as Z-O-G-G. All right, so we are in the middle of Tennessee, just outside Manchester. How did you get into classic cars? The raw performance that they had, the raw speed, it's a, it's a missing era, and I just kind of want to have a part of that. Uh, 1971 uh, Plymouth Troubleshooting Contest. We won in the area, and then we went on to win the Northern California Championship, we got to go to the National Finals, which was in Indianapolis. But that's actually where we had the contest was on the track. They lined up all the cars of all things. It was a bunch of <laughs> crappy old 1971 Plymouth Dusters with slant sixes in them. And uh, anybody who's not familiar with the troubleshooting contest, they would uh, purposely mess up the cars and, and uh, the car wouldn't be running it might not even be cranking it might have a bad starter relay and uh, they'd start us out all at the same time you had the same tools uh, everybody had everything the same and uh, we were one of the first cars out of the block we got to meet uh, Socks and Martin and we also got to meet Richard Petty 2.30 Central, 3.30 Eastern, and we are exhausted. He's more exhausted than me, because he got to drive the whole time, <laughs> and I slept. <laughs> Let's go to bed. Uh, so um, we're going to head out, so we'll see you tomorrow.